What's up everybody? Welcome to another episode of the Island Vlog. I got two big things to show you today. The first one is I gotta show you the finished White House. The second one is I gotta show you the progress on the pavilion that's going up over the basketball court out in the field. So here we go. All right, so if you guys remember back to the spring, I walked you through the White House when it was still under construction. Uh, we were hanging drywall and painting and trying to get it all done. Well, I'm happy to show you today the completed project. So I'm gonna take you guys inside, show you around a little bit. I think you're gonna like it. So check this out, this is the brand new lobby of the White House. You remember, we wanted to keep the stone staircase. We really wanted to keep this stone fireplace because this is an old building. It's historic, originally built in 1928. And so we wanted to keep some of that aesthetic in here, but then of course, updating everything else. This is a little seating area right here. Over here, um, there's gonna be a little coffee bar station where anybody can come uh, get coffee over here. Still some of the little final details about to finish up. Down the hallway on the first floor, right down here, we got uh, 10 rooms total here in the White House. I'm gonna take you guys upstairs and I'm gonna show you one of the rooms and what they look like. So we're up here, this is room number 10. This is one of our biggest rooms. There's two of these that um, are really big. One on the second floor, one on the first floor. Got the big king size bed in here. Check out these bathrooms. You guys saw these when they're under construction, but now they're finished. This one's got the tub in it and uh, just beautiful tile finishes. And then of course, every room in here has its own air conditioner. So you can keep the room just at the perfect temperature for how you like it. You can see in here, got the little mini fridge, and this, this is just a perfect room if you are coming, spending the week here, wanting to stay close to your students while they're here on the island with us. And so all the other rooms right now have people in them, so I'm not gonna be able to show you uh, any of the other ones, but this is just give you a sneak peek. They all um, have are just like this. They're just configured a little bit differently, but we'd love to have you. If you're a youth leader or a youth pastor or pastor and you're bringing students here to the island, these rooms are for you. So check us out. You got to call 518-494-6000. Talk to Craig or Mackenzie. They can get you one of these rooms booked. We're not quite open yet for next summer, but we will be opening registration for next summer very soon so that you can get in, reserve this room before they're all gone. Like I said, there's a limited number of these. We have 10 total, eight that we're renting out right now to youth leaders. So, so there you go. That's a little update on the White House. We're so excited about this. Great place for leaders to come when they're here on the island. A lot of progress. If you go back and watch the video from before, it was crazy that they got all this work done in the amount of time that they did, but that's not it. We're walking over. I gotta show you the new pavilion that's going in. While we're walking over there, I'm gonna turn the camera around and just give you guys uh, some of the sights and sounds of camp. So you can see over here, we got a uh, nine square in the air, got some pickup basketball going on. We got the Gaga court over here, people playing Gaga. We're walking over here. This is the space we call Top of the Rock. And uh, that's where everybody's just hanging out. We got the snack shack up here. We got the camp store. You can see just a place for people to hang out. Here's the snack shack over here. Everybody's just kind of chilling up here. Wait, Say what's up to the vlog. What's, what's up? up? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> right in here. This is the coffee shop, so they have all kinds of awesome, look at this thing right here. That is the Frappuccino of the day today, and uh, this is just a great place to hang out, get some coffee, and so yeah, that's the coffee house. 
I still have yet to show you guys the brand new, uh, freshly remodeled kitchen and dining room, but that's coming up probably on the next episode here. So stay tuned for that. You don't want to miss it. While we're talking about it, don't forget, subscribe to the Island YouTube channel. Stay up to date with everything that's going on. Not only are you gonna get access to these vlogs, all the updates here on the island, you're also gonna see the week in review videos coming through as they come out throughout the summer. We're gonna be making announcements and doing giveaways, all kinds of crazy stuff throughout the year. So hit that subscribe button, turn the bell on, and of course, we always appreciate it when you like and share. Oh, subscribe and like the video! <laughs> Leave, Leave a, a comment, comment and hit the like button. Double Bye. Walking past the turf court down here. This is, we've had this turf court for a long time. It's such a great activity space for us. We play so many activities down here. Of course, the legendary Boobar Bash happens out here. It just happened last night, Monday night here on the island. So, okay, um, I'm, I'm coming up on our pavilion. We're not gonna call it the pavilion because we already have Pine Pavilion, but I'm coming up here on this project. So far, I've shown you guys like different stages of the project. We went all the way back to early in the spring. I showed you when they were just kind of breaking up the ground and getting it ready. The last time I was out here, I showed you guys how they just had one big metal cross beam and they made a lot of progress since then. Look at this. So you can see they're, they're about three quarters of the way done with it. Um, half of it over there already has the roof on it. They're finishing up putting the trusses right up here. But this building is huge. I mean, let me go down here to where there's an opening and you'll just see exactly how big these openings are. I mean, so it's got open sides from here down stays open that way the wind uh, the air can move freely underneath it. That'll keep the temperature nice and cool, make it much more enjoyable to play in here. Um, there's gonna be lights and a sound system, all that, but look how big this thing is. It's got one full-size court this way and then two courts that go side to side on the court as well here. So plenty of space for a lot of basketball great progress happening here i'm going to take you guys over here we have a 3d rendering of it i'll show you guys that so you can get an idea of um, just what the finished product is going to look like but lots of progress out here we're so excited about this for next year here's a 3d rendering to give you an idea of what it's going to look like so you can see the open sides here big roof it's kind of oriented the wrong way that's the peak obviously, but that'll give you an idea of what to expect. Next year, right over here on the island coming in 2023. Two big updates, the White House finished product and the progress out here on this pavilion over the basketball court. One thing that we still have not come up with is a name for what we're gonna call this. Obviously, like I said, we don't wanna call it the pavilion or the pavilion core. It's too close to Pine Pavilion, which is already a very significant structure for us. So what do you guys think? Do you have any ideas for names that we could call that structure out there? We gotta call it, we gotta call it something. So if you got an idea, leave it in the comments below. We'll see, maybe we'll, maybe we'll find the name to the building right here on YouTube. Uh, it wouldn't be the first time we've named a building based off of comments that we got on the internet. So drop it below and there we go. That's a little look at our updates and life on the island for you. We'll see you guys next time.